Okay, I'm going to do something different here with some of my old coins. Now these are all coins from the 1800s. All except for this one here in this group that I'm not sure. Okay, and what I'm doing is I want you to choose one coin that if you had these coins you would send to be graded to be put in the big auction, the big coin auctions. Okay, so I need a little help. So if you know of others who know about coins and stuff like that, get them all in on it too, okay? Let them come and choose and help me out. All right, because I'm at the age, it's time to sell them off. Here we go. This is our first one here. Eighteen sixty-one. This one looks like it's been in water or something. Look at that. Almost looks like extra letters here. Oh, and look at that. Looks like something right there too. Definitely showing up a little different, huh? And then on this side here, if you look, look at that. Right there, along with all her face and stuff, kind of smooth on the Victoria. All right, so that's the first one. Not in the best condition, I don't think, but it's in the group here. Next, we have this one here, 1846. Patine's pretty good. It's not all worn out. Got a few extra little marks on it. Not too bad. But remember, these are coins from the 1800s. And they have one cent. United States of America. So that's the second one. And we have another one of those. A little bit more. Oh, a little harder there. 1853. Been through some hard time, but look at the tint in it. The one cent. But it's got that little bump right there. Kind of didn't go all the way through. But it definitely has been through something. Okay, then we have a couple of the Indian head pennies. Well, this one's at eighteen ninety-five. Pretty good patine on it. And then one cent, look at that, not all worn out. Pretty good. If you notice how this one is, and then we have one that's thicker. Look at the difference in the thickness. So on this one here, here's your one cent. Very good. Patine's nice. Not all worn out. The thicker one. And it's still United States, 1863. Alright, just thicker than the other ones. Oh, that was meant to last, wasn't it? Okay. So we'll just go by the numbers. One, two, three, four. Second row. One, two, three. Go like that. And we have this one here. Beautiful. It's all by the years this way here with our Roman numerals. that. Beautiful, isn't it? What a beautiful coin. Look at the details of that. All right. So these are the ones to choose from. This is only batch one. I decided I'm doing this with all the coins that are just in the 1800s, except for that one there, of course, that I'm not sure. But I'm going through just the 1800s of the coins that I have. Put them in group. Choose one. 
and then we'll take it from there. All right, I can't have them all graded. It's too expensive. <laughs> Unless you know somebody who will grade it for free. <laughs> you know, if they get in on a deal or something, they see one that's really, ooh, I'll grade that one for free if I get a percentage, you know. Then, okay, we can talk it. But for right now, go ahead and choose one. If you know coin dealers and stuff like that, let them check these things out. See if there's one that they feel should be graded for the big auction. Alrighty, bye-bye now. Be sure to follow me and share the video.